Fighters from the so-called Islamic State are reportedly on the retreat in the Syrian city of Palmyra, which they captured last year. Government troops are said to have retaken the desert city's old citadel. Earlier, in another blow to the extremist group, the U.S. said its forces had killed several senior ISIL leaders, including its second-in-command. This Syrian army officer said this victory happened because of the will and determination of the soldiers in battle. We've liberated Palmyra Castle and the remnants of the militants are fleeing in the direction of Raqqa and Deir al-Zor. In Iraq, too, the army has launched an offensive against ISIL around Mosul, its main bastion. The extremists are said to have been pushed out of several villages in the region. Iraqi troops have set up base alongside Kurdish Peshmerga and U.S. forces some 60 kilometers to the south, but they're said to have made slow progress on Friday. A Kurdish news agency has released film of Yazidi women and children in an emotional reunion with family members after being recently freed from ISIL captivity. Some described the abuse they'd suffered at the hands of the militants.